Welcome back to another episode of my Minnesota Dynasty here on NCAA 13. We're coming off a nice win against uh, Iowa, who was ranked. And after that win, we are ranked. Uh, Lowry dropped to ninth in passing yards. He's he's not he's not gonna get it because of his injury. <gasps> um, Terrell Turner is tenth in receiving yards. McFadden is fifth in tackles. Right, so we we got some guys. We got some guys up there. We got some guys. Um, in terms of Lowry's injury, he will miss this game and the next game. But like I said in the last episode, if uh if if Jason Lacey plays well, uh he could he could keep the spot. Uh I'm gonna check to see if we got any players of the week. We did not. So we only have one this season. That was Patrick Cook against Miami. So this is gonna be our first game as a ranked team. We're ranked number twenty one. We're taking on number twenty two Ohio State. Let's hop into it. Here we are in the game. You see uh, Matt Young for Ohio State there. Not sure who that is. Probably a, he looks like a linebacker or a running back. This is an at Ohio State game, so it's going to be tough. We're going to get the ball first. Try to get a nice start on offense. Take an early lead. All right, we're underway here. Turner getting the ball from about four yards deep. I'm just going to keep it in. Take the touchback. Have Jason Lacey come out, see what he can do. As SMU beats Houston. SMU putting together a nice little season. Now I'm gonna try to run the ball a lot more this game because it's it, because with Lacey only being a 67 and with him only being a true freshman, there's going to be a lot. Any fumble, <sighs> fumbles on the. It looked like he was down. I really hope he's down. <laughs> I. It looked like he, yeah, he's down. It's gonna go into booth review. Okay, we're good. We're good. Alright, we're good. Stan Smith picks up three on the opening run. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Now, um, Lacey did have a really good game to end last week. He had, uh, what was it, three or four? I think he had three touchdowns. And only like a half, or less than a half, or two, two and a half quarters or something. As Nick White gets the first down right there. So yeah, he definitely played he had he had a great game last week. He had a rushing touchdown and two passing touchdowns. So I'm hoping he can keep, he can keep some of that momentum and bring it into this game. First and ten. Blitz coming. Hitting Michael right over the middle. He hangs on, surprisingly. And takes it up into Ohio State territory to the forty. First and ten. Another hand off to Stan Smith. Bouncing it back left. Bounces off a blocker and picks up five. Nice opening drive we got here. Now this is something I can do with Lacey that I couldn't really do with Lowry is the is the option game. And it didn't really go anywhere that time. We only pick up one, but that's definitely something I'm gonna come back to later in the game. Alright, third and four. It's a pretty big third down. I'm looking at Cook and I'm looking at Wright underneath. Or not that's not Cook, that's Nick White. Somehow, we caught that. That was a terrible throw by me. I threw it into double coverage, and it sneaked through both of the defenders. I don't know. That that should have been picked. It went right through them. That was very lucky. I cannot lie, but I will take that. Ooh, we got, we got the, the backup receivers in the game now. I don't like that. Can I get a run up the middle? That play, that gets blown up. I did say earlier that I was going to try to run the ball a lot more this game. As that we almost had him right there. That was going to be a first down at least to McNamara. I did say I was going to try to run the ball a lot more this game. But if the Clemson run D is, is uh, playing well, I'm not going to force anything. There's no point in me to, to, to continue running the ball if we're not going to pick anything up. All right, third and 14. Pretty big down here to start off this opening drive. That was that was a terrible throw. This is gonna be a long field goal. I don't even know if we're gonna be able to make this. It's gonna be forty one yards. I'm gonna try to kick it myself, which might not be the brightest idea, but we're gonna go for it. The kick is up. The kick is good. 
Let's go. Starting off with an early 3 nothing lead. First and 10. Ohio State. I believe that's Braxton Miller. I think. As first plays an option. It's a triple option. Throws it out to the, to the wide receiver. And Nate Hill just put the hits on him. What a hit that was. Now we're going to have to put up a spy from probably a lot of this game. But this, this looks like a run, so I'm just going to leave it. Leave the man coverage. It's out out to Moore and a big hit from... Uh, what's his name? <laughs> what's, his, what's the strong safety's name? I don't remember. As Tennessee's up 7-0 on Georgia. A little bit of an upset there. McFadden, that's his name. McFadden. I couldn't remember it for a second. Ohio State starting this drive off in pretty good field position. We play action, and there's no spy. Big hits, but he takes it up to the 41. First and 10. It's going to be a pass. Throw to Gatson. I don't know what the linebacker's doing. <laughs> He's just standing there. All you have to do is step up. <sighs> Yeah, I, I just, we need, we, I, next, I mean, I, I, I might assign a couple pass rushers this, uh, this off season just to have some more guys. Send the blitz, he takes off, Spy makes him slide, he picks up three, studio update. Wisconsin ranked number four and Purdue are tied, okay. Upset Bruin there. But yeah, I have one more spot left in this class, I think I'm just going to sign a defensive end. Just keep adding to the depth because we need some elite guys. And that corner got burnt off the line, but we get the sack. Let's go. I think that was Stover who got in there. Like, the pass rush isn't bad, per se, but it, it's not great either. I mean, it, it, especially because our best, our best defensive lineman's leaving this season, and then our next one, our, our next best one's leaving next season. Throwing it up to the, to the sideline. It didn't let me jump, but he's out of bounds. All right, Ohio State's looking to tie it up 3-3 with this field goal. And it's frozen. I don't know what that was. It just stopped working on that. The, re the recording just did not work on that kick. I, got, I would pause the game, and it would be fine. But I don't know what it was. But when they were lined up in that, in that field goal formation, it was just not working. <laughs> oh, that's a terrible throw. I, I gotta stop leading it. I think that's my problem. I'm leading it like it's Madden, and it just doesn't work like that. Like, they lead it, but it's always inaccurate, so I just gotta stop leading it. Second and ten, I'm just gonna try to pick up something here. Got Nick White underneath. He picks up one. It's not the way I wanted that play to go. I was trying to cut it up and pick up five, but... And they got Joey. I think that's Joey Bosa. I might, I might be... <laughs> I might not be Joey Bosa. What number did what number did he wear? I don't I don't know. Third now I'm gonna try to get this play off before the second quarter. And pressure gets in. That's a sack. Forced to punt again. Ohio State starting another drive off in pretty good territory and see if they can capitalize. Only got a field goal on the last drive. Starting off with a run. We're we're in there with Stewart. He breaks off Coleman, can't bring him down either. And we finally bring him down, but he picks up like 20 and breaks two tackles. Tackling definitely is iffy. It's Wisconsin's up seven on Purdue. That's something that'll just get better over time. We got we have we have young linebackers, so they'll I mean they'll get upgraded next season. Pressure off that edge! That is Carter with his fourth sack of the season, I believe. And we send that blitz and get at him. Love to see that. I think Watson is... No, nah, Watson's another guy. I think he's a redshirt freshman. I redshirted him last year. Scrambling. And we stop him for a gain of three. Nice job by the defensive end and the D-tackle there. 
Ohio State is 0 for 2 on third downs this game. Let's see if we can make it 0 for 3. And that's guys wide open over the top. Coleman got beat. That's a touchdown. 10 3. All right, here we are, first and 10. And that's an incomplete pass. This pass rush is just killing us. And I can't run the ball either because run blocking has been awful. Second and 10. I'm starting off in the speed option, but I'm probably not going to run it. I'm going to switch out of it to a play action pass. I like Turner 101 on that outside. And I can't even get that off, man. We had 80, we had Cook right underneath. Would have got some yards, but pass this pass rush, man. Just, I just not, I'm not able to do anything. Third and ten. And again, I, I can't, I can't, I just can't do anything. I'm forced to punt it again. First and ten for Ohio State again, in decent field position because we're never able to get any yards on offense. Just on that drive with a read option, and I bring him down with Thompson from behind. That was a good play by the defensive end, too. I think that might have been Carter out there. I want to get the freshman defensive ends more involved. I just, I'm just i just not sure how to do that without benching one of the starters. I mean, my sub-out rates aren't, aren't crazy high or anything. And that was a good play by Thomas there. He kind of uh, he got around, and even though, even though he didn't bring him down, he slowed him down to let other guys get over there. But yeah, I'd like to let like Dobzinski play and guys like that at, at the defensive end slots. Third and seven. Let's see what they're gonna do. It's gonna be a pass. Everything's locked up. And oh, that was that wasn't locked up, but it was an incomplete. Fourth and seven. Good stop by the defense. All right, first and ten on this next drive. Starting off with a run to Stan Smith. Nice blocks. Picking up nine. Nice start to the drive. Studio update. Let's see. Tennessee's up seven on fifth ranked Georgia. Just trying to find something to. Just to pick this first down up. Safeties are creeping up. That's not good. Going to keep it. There's nothing but room. Lacey. If, if Cook just held on for that block a little longer, we could have been out of there. But we still pick up the first down. Nice. I mean, I'll, that, that, that was the goal right there. And now it's first and ten. I just got to keep everything short. That's how we drove down the field the first time. That and a couple lucky plays. Just keep everything short, and then get run after get yards after catch, just like that, up to the forty. All right, first and ten here. Again, just short passes. Nick White, first down. I would love to take a shot deep, but I it, it's similar to the Alabama game where they they just have so much talent on their team that like like so much speed on their team that we just can't get behind them. But first and ten, speed option. Probably could have probably could have tossed that. We picked up three though. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna cancel the play action, but I'm still gonna put him on that route. I think I'm gonna change uh, Turner's route to just a drag. Just give me an extra check down. Turner picks up three. I saw that pressure coming. Had to had to get out of there quickly. All right, it's third and four. I, I kind of want to run this screen. I'm gonna come out in it, but I'm not sure if it's gonna be the move. If the yeah, if they're coming out and press, I'm not. I'm not. Lacey, first down. Let's go, man. Into Ohio State territory. Nice run. First and ten. Let's say that first down. Can we get that into McNamara? Yes, we can. Good job by him hanging on too. He's a guy that I've really liked. He's a, he doesn't play much. But when he plays, he plays well. That's for sure. Here we are, first and ten again. I'm just trying to... Who the hell is that? That's not good. Oh, he's hurt, isn't he? And he's throwing dimes, but... Oh my god. <laughs> I might have to turn off injuries just until Lowry comes back. Alright, it's only back spasm, so he will be back soon, but yeah, I might I might have to turn off injuries until Lowry's back because I, I can't be using a third string quarterback. Yeah, he's not even a quarterback. I don't even know what position he is because he's not a quarterback. We only have two on the roster. 
He's a punter. Alright, whatever. We'll leave him in. We'll let him cook. He's done two. He's, he's two for two so far, so. And Stan Smith, nice run, picks up the first. Gonna call a timeout. Just trying to give me as much time for... Yeah, put... But he's... Oh, no. I don't know what to do. I'm just going to keep, keep the punter in just for now. Just for this half. Just for the rest of this half. I'm probably just going to run the ball. for <laughs> Just run this out. I don't want to pass anything and risk a pick or anything. I can't even audible. So we're going to have to do a jet sweep to the tight end because, of course, we do. And Daniels actually picks up seven, so... Not a bad play there. Second and three. Just going to keep everything short. I'm going to try a screen. <laughs> this is this is a disaster. He's open, though. Stan Smith. The punter gets a touchdown. Let's go, man. That's not, it's exa that's not what I expected to happen this game. But it's what happened. Let's go. And we tied the game up with the punter. All right, first and ten for Ohio State. Let's see if we can hold them here before halftime and go and head into halftime with it with it being a tie game. Gonna scramble. Big hit by McFadden, but he still picks up the first. It's just these the defensive linemen just can't keep up with him. I, I gotta put a de defensive end on a spy. At least it's a bit quicker. All right, let's see. First and ten again. Gonna scramble. Stover's there and Carter's there. They bring him down. I don't know if that counts as a sack or not, but if it does, that's our third of the game. Which is more than I mean we didn't I don't I don't even think we had one last week. Yeah, that is a sack, so nice. I think that's Carter's second of the game as well. Or one and a half. I don't know if that if that will count as a full sack. He's gonna scramble again and big hit by Carter right there. Clock is draining. I'm just trying to head into halftime. I would call a timeout here, but I'm just trying to head into halftime with, uh... Got two guys on spies here. Guard in this middle. Comeback route's open. And he gets it. No, man, no! They're going to know how to unspike it. Yep. I think they're going to spike it. No, they're not. Okay. Alright, put the spies up. Waste a look at some clocks being wasted here. Nothing's open, and that is Stover with the sack. And that's likely going to take us to halftime. Great coverage and great pass rush getting in there as well. They're going to call out timeout with five seconds left. I'm just going to come out in three-man deep, and, um, yeah, I just, just hope that we can uh, hold this. We got Ross in the game. See, that? that's, that's, that's a freshman that I want to get playing time is Ross. Definitely want to play him a lot. They're throwing it up. Hail Mary. Bunch of guys there. We're unable to come down to the with the pick, but that's gonna take us into halftime. 10-10 studio update. Tennessee's up 10 on Georgia. And I just looked at the injury report. Uh, uh, Jason Lacey should be back for this game. Uh, should come back when next time we're on offense. And that's just terrible coverage by Mitchell. Haven't really blitzed that many times this game, mainly because the pass rush has been getting there. But looks like they're in Wildcat here. I get around with that Stewart. I get around the edge with Stewart, and we bring him down for the TFL. Good play by the uh, defensive lineman coming off, the, coming off that left side as well. Let's see, second and thirteen. Play action again. I was on. I'm on the comeback route, and big hit forces the fumble. Williams recovers. Who was that? Who forced that? Was that McFadden? I think that might have been McFadden. Who was just sitting, or I don't know who it was. Yeah, it was McFadden. Just sitting in the slot, not really moving anywhere. And he comes in with a scramble and just puts him on the dirt. Let's go. What a play. We're starting off in great field position. First and 10. Starting this drive off, not with a speed option. Going to switch it to a, just a base run. Try to pick up a couple. Bouncing it back inside, picking up five. Second and five, got a jet sweep to uh, Patrick Cook here. Blocks were terrible. We pick up one, third and four. All right, let's see, let's see what we can work with here. Not really feeling any of these plays. Just gonna go in and uh, call it myself then. 
Only need four yards, so I'm not going to try to do anything too deep. I know this is, isn't exactly the most check down play in the world, but... That's Michael Wright with the grab inside the 15 down to the 11. Let's go, man. First and 10 from the 11. Running a screen to Cook here. It's open, and we pick up five. He was just a bit quicker, man. See Lacey with 104 passing yards. I believe he has a pick. I think I threw a pick this game. But it was... No. No, no, no. We don't have a pick. Unless... I, I don't know. I, I think we... I don't know. I don't remember. But second and five from the six. Gonna run it. Gonna run it here. And we pick up three. I mean, I gotta go to the end zone. I might just run a screen again. Work last time. Probably will work again. If I can find it. Right here. Oh, wrong... We're in a damn jet sweep. Right, I'm going to call a timeout because I want to score here. And I'm going to come out and run that screen. If it doesn't work, I'll just take my three. We, we kind of got lucky here anyway because we, we got that fumble. So I'll take that. And I'm just going to run this screen here and uh, hopefully we can get into the end zone. Pass it. Yep, lose a couple yards. We'll just take our... Well, I'll, I'll take my three. Go up three. And we ended up missing the field goal. So that's wonderful. First and ten for Ohio State. It's going to be a run. We get there with Thomas. And we bring him down for the TFL. This defense has been very good this season. Like, even this game, outside of that one long uh, receiving touchdown, they've done, like, nothing. I mean, this defense has been very good. And we don't even have, like, it's a very young defense, too. Like, a majority of these guys coming back outside of the safety and, uh, and one of the corners. They, they, they call the screens not open. That's John Jones with the sack. Nice three and out by the defense. All right, first and ten. Starting this drive already in Ohio State territory. Stan Smith with the run. Stan Smith, huge gain. 16-yard pickup. Definitely going to miss him, um... Definitely, he's he's going to be a big loss heading into next season. But we we have a nice running. We have Albert Williams, who's a nice backup. We got a couple of nice. We got a nice freshman that's redshirted this season, so they can come in and make some noise as well. Trying to run with Lacey gets hit stick, but he picks up three. Don't be hurt. Good, good, good. Yeah, that's definitely one thing I like more that that Lacey has that Lowry doesn't is the just the mobility. So if, if that's Larry right there, I just have to take the sack because I'm not getting through that. But with Lacey, I mean, I mean, Lowry is is not slow, but he has like 79 speed. And I mean, Lacey's faster than that, and Lacey probably has better acceleration, better agility, stuff like that. Second and seven. Fit that into right. He drops it. Come on. He, I mean, he, I was gonna, I was gonna say he's a guy that I'm definitely not gonna miss, but I mean, he's a, he's a junior, so we, we still have a season. We still have one more season with him. I, I might bench him. McNamara plays so much better than him in the in the limited snaps that he gets. That's a terrible throw. We had Cook open too, and he's injured. No. No! Now we gotta play with the punter again. 43 yards. We made one from 41. One's a bit funky. With the wind, that one is up and it's good. 13-10. Should be 16-10, but we had a bit of a mistake. Alright, it's it's only... I mean, it's an abdominal strain and it's... His re-injury risk is medium. I'm just gonna put him back in because we need him. I can't play with the punter, especially in a game like this. First and ten. It's gonna be shovel option. We're all over that. He tosses it. McFadden's all over that, bringing him down for a six-yard loss. He would have been better off just keeping it. Another good play by the defense, man. They've been they've been just balling these past couple weeks. Let's see what we can do here. It's gonna be a pat. It's gonna be a run. I mean. McFadden brings him down after he picks up three. Two nice plays for McFadden in a row, bringing up third and 13. All right, we just got to sit back. Sit back into deep coverage. 
and just leave everything in front of me. Just leave everything in front. Gonna uh, gonna put a spy on both the defensive ends to give a little bit more speed. That's a comeback route. Those have killed us this game, man. Those have killed us this game. It's been that one guy. <laughs> that has just killed us on those comeback routes. Parker. I I'm sure that's an NFL receiver. I'll search him up. Uh, probably after this play. And the scramble. We have no guys back. He fumbles. More with the recovery. Let's go, man. That's uh, that's Braxton Miller's second fumble this game. And that puts us... In a great spot. Alright, I searched up who the receiver was, and it's Corey Brown. He uh, he played for the Panthers a little bit when they had uh, Cam Newton, and they were like in the in those seasons that they went that in those really good seasons that they had. Just throw that away. That's that's terrible. And yeah, he plays for the Bills now, still in the league. So yeah, at least he's not some bum cooking us. But uh, here we are. I gotta run. I want to run a read option. They they seem to work. I, I like them a lot more than uh than speed options because it. I don't know. I I feel like it just works better in my opinion. All right, this is gonna be the last play of the uh, third quarter. No, no matter what happens here. The only thing I'm worried about is an injury. Can I hand it off to Stan Smith? Blockers are there. Cut it back inside. He picks up. Nine, bringing up third and inches. It's going to be a, a, an important play to start off the fourth. All right, third and inches. Got another read option here. Going to keep it with Lacey and lose three. Should have just did a normal handoff there. Now, it is only fourth and three. I'm tempted to go for it here. I'm going to put on conservatives. Just try to wait some clock. I'm very tempted to go for it here. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm going to. The defense has played so well that I'm really not even stressing about that. And if we can pick this up, that would just be great. Nick White? And he's short. Damn it, man. I should have just thought it up to B. I mean, worst case scenario, it's a pick. And, I mean, basically a punt at that point. I mean, that's... I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Because, I mean, if we get that, game's basically over. But... It's always 20-20. Cuts back inside. Thomas with a nice play. I mean, yeah, like I said, this defense has been playing so well, I'm not even worried about them. It's going to be another draw. Moore brings them down. Third and six. I mean, like, we've played very well. We've done a great job stopping the run. I mean, Ohio State has one of the best run offenses, and I think they're, like, number four. And we have the number two run defense, so it's a pretty evenly matched up game. Another run. We blow it up with Hill, but we can't bring him down, and, more, and uh, Coleman can't. Coleman misses him, and he gets down to the 26. It's just these the, the tackling, man. We've missed so many tackles. And not even just this game. Like, every game, we have missed tackles, and that's really what cost us. We had a chance right there to stop him in the backfield. Pressure comes in. I didn't even see him. Wow, that's that's that. now that's my fault. I blitzed with more. I didn't even see the tight end sneak out. That's my fault right there. Let's see if we can get this goal line stop, man. I, I think we can. I got faith. It's going to be a pass. I, I get in with like McFadden and 49. I don't know who the hell that was. That was uh, Carter. We have like four guys named Carter on this defensive line. But he made a great play there. Second and goal. It's another pass. We get through Hill with the sack. That's his second sack of his young career. And third and third and goal from the eight. We got a bunch of de backup defensive linemen in. I don't like that. But it's third. Oh, come on, man. One, one more, one more play. Defense. Back of the end zone. That's a touchdown. I don't know what Moore is doing. Seventeen, thirteen. All right, first and ten here. Just trying to pick up some yards. On first down. Hit to get it. And then Turner. Turner with a lot of space. Turner off to the races. Turner. He could go all the way. Touchdown. Let's go, man. What a way to answer back. Turner takes the drag route to the house. One play, one touchdown. Let's go, man. That's the that's my that's the number one receiver right there. One of the best receivers in the nation. All right, the defense gets another chance to make up for what they did on the last drive. He's running. Thomas is all over that though. Brings him down for two yards. I I like that right there. I like putting the 
with the linebackers on a spy, it makes me feel like, I mean, it, it makes me, it, it, damn it, I <laughs> called the wrong play, I meant to call the same, the, the play we just ran, but it makes me feel safer, because of that speed, and, and they're able to, ooh, that, that route is open, Mitchell, almost, oh, come on, man, he almost broke off that, I broke off his route, and, and ended up picking that off, but, couldn't quite get it. First and ten. Ross in the game. Yeah, I like I like to see that though. I like I like getting Ross in playing time. He's gonna be pretty important next year. First and ten. That's wide open. Why 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 do we have Marshall in the game or whatever Mason Marshall I don't care what his name is. Why is he in the game? And why are we in cover that that's the main problem. I, I ran cover two right there. Never run cover two unless you want to get cooked. First and ten, though. Only rushing two. It's a screen. We're all over that. Bring him down with Stewart for a one yard game. For a loss of one, actually. Sorry. If we get home to a field goal here, that'd be nice. And we'll have a chance to, uh. Maybe a bunch of backups in the game. Don't like that. But second and eleven. Let's see what we can do here. Guy in motion. It's gonna be it's gonna be a, a shovel option, and he jukes Ross, but Mitchell and Carter combined for the tackle. Third and twelve, yeah. He just just I mean the 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 freshman Ross was there, just couldn't. I mean he just he just shook him. But here we are, third and twelve, man. Come on, defense. One more play. I don't like that we have Marshall in the game. I'm gonna sit up. Terrible throw. Let's go. Fourth and twelve. They're gonna have to settle for three. And it's going to be a tough field goal as well. It's going to be... What is that? I mean, they made a they made a 44-yarder. This is basically the same thing. Kick is up. Kick is good. That was a boomer. 20-20. We got about two minutes to, to take the lead. All right, first and 10. Could be the game-winning drive right here. And I almost just... <laughs> Almost just threw it away right there. Oh, that would have been that would have been just embarrassing. I mean, he was open, but I shouldn't have thrown it because I was on the run and getting sacked and everything. I should have just thrown it away or took the sack. Fit that into not great, not a great start. Not a great start. We need ten yards here. I mean, I'm gonna try to run something to pick it up, obviously, but. I highly doubt we can get this. I'm going to send... Is that X on the outside? Yeah, that's Nick White. I'm going to send him deep. He has a step. Can Lacey get it there? He can! Nick White with the grab! Nick White down to the 20! What a throw and what a catch! Let's go, man. Let's go. Only has 82 speed, but he still somehow gets behind the defense. Love to see that. Just going to put it on balance now. Oh, what a what a what a game this is, man! What a game! First, I run to Stan Smith here. Blocks are there. He picks up five. Fifty-seven yards on the day, which is actually a lot more than I expected him to have. I thought he was going to struggle, especially after the start he had, because I didn't like the first three rushes went nowhere. But still, I mean, he's he's played really well. He had that nice fifteen-yard run. He had a seventeen-yard run. Yeah, he's had some nice runs. Second and five here. Right out the middle. That's a first down. Are they going to call a timeout? No, they're not. I'm, I'm going to take... I don't know. I could probably score a touchdown here, right? I mean, obviously. but And then give them a little bit of time to maybe tie it up. But I'd rather do that than take a field goal because I suck at kicking. Put on, I'm just going to put it on balance and just run the ball. And then hope to God I make the kick. I'm going to try a jet sweep here to, uh, who's that? Is that Cook? It is Cook. I mean, if I have a chance to score a touchdown, I'm taking it. I'm not going to not score a touchdown. Juking back inside, and we pick up, pick up one. Okay, I'm just going to let the clock go down to about three seconds. I'm going to call a timeout. All right. <laughs> Oh, this could be a huge win, man. This is going to bump us up in the rankings a little bit. 
We gotta make this kick though first. I mean, I'm two for two on kicks this game, so. Because the one I missed, I simmed, which I shouldn't do. Since our kicker's decent. Five, four, three. I'm gonna call it now. Oh, this is so nerve wracking. Because I'm not. Because I know there's. 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 There's kicker ice. Eh, they're gonna do it. No. I don't like that. Kick is up and the kick is good. Let's go, man. Let's go. The linemen are hype. And we take a 3 nothing lead. And I'm going to kick an onside kick just so that I hope it doesn't go to bounds. Yeah, just so I can waste this second. Perfect. That's the game. What a game that was, man. Oh, my God. Let's go. Let's go. What a game. What a game that was. Oh, you see the, the punter, 3 for 3 and a touchdown. Jason Lacey, 14 for 25, 227 and a touchdown. And had some clutch throws at the end. Stan Smith with another nice game, 13 for 65. Uh, receiving, Nick White with 77. Had that huge play at the end of the game that basically won us the game. Um, Michael Wright with uh, 4 for 59 also had that drop. Terrell Turner, I'm going to miss him so much. <laughs> it's going to suck without him. 3 for 82. He, he basically won us the game with that, with that touchdown. Uh, Stan Smith also had a touchdown. Cook only had 5 yards. McNamara with 12 and Williams with 13. Okay, sacks. David Carter with 2. Stover with 2. Um, Stover's an All-American as well, so that's nice. Um, Jones with one and a half, Nate, uh, Nate Hill with one, and Dustin Mitchell, who, that's the Juco guy we picked up, I'm pretty sure. So it's nice to, nice to see him making some plays. Uh, def pass deflections, Frank Moore with one. Force fumble, Steve Morris with one, and John McFadden with one. Cameron Moore and TJ Williams on the recoveries. What a huge win that was, uh. Oh, sh you see right there, after the game, we get another commit to this class. I believe his name, it's, it's Luke or Logan Swanson. It's one of them, too. So we're 5-1 and one heading into Week 7. We got Northwestern up next. Let's see where they're going to rank us. Number 18. Herb Street has us winning this one. Northwestern's only 2-2. Two and two. I'm pretty sure we beat them last year. Um, recruiting news... I don't believe there's that much. So we, we do have all 25 slots filled up. But I think I'm going to drop a guy and pick up a defensive end. So Will Conley's ready to come on a visit. Um, and that's it. I got some guys to scout. Alright. I'll update you guys in the next episode. But uh, that's going to be it for this one. If you enjoyed, please hit like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.